Okay, I'm going to talk about the data model for the hex game. And uh, you can see here I've got a collection of all games. And I've got documents in here. And the document has uh, a bunch of these fields, including this long move list, uh, which we can collapse. And uh, then it's got another collection, which is called chat. And uh, you know, the chat has a, a bunch of fields, like message and mood number, name, UID, uh, picture UID, which is always null on a timestamp. It's added by the server. So um, over here in the, oops, over here, this is all uh, determined by the, the model, which I give you, but we have a board dimension, it's a square board, so you just need one number. We have a Firestore ID that's, um, uh, unique identifier uh, assigned at the server. There's the first player UID. There's the list of moves, which is just a flat list because doing pairs sort of doesn't really work in the, the Firestore data model. And then we have a name list and we have a UID list. And we made these lists so that it's easy to search uh, for like Betty Rubble we can find all games that Betty Rubble was either the uh, the first player is the um, red player, I think, and the second player is the blue player. I should have should have looked that up before I said that. Um, <clears throat> same thing with the the UID. So that that's really the whole uh, shebang. So this is you know a Firestore game really is this thing, and it has these um, fields and you use this to set up the view and then you sort of go through the, the move list um, as, as, you, as you use the controls if you're doing a replay game. Uh, yeah, that's, that's really it. Okay.